This will be a synopsis of On the Resurrection by Justin Martyr. This work only exists in fragments, quoted by later authors. It's a short work, only 10 chapters, and the primary purpose of this document is to address the mechanics of resurrection. Justin seems to quote from one of the three synoptic gospels, probably Luke, but the quotes are also consistent with Matthew and Mark. There is also a single quote in chapter 9 that appears to be consistent with Acts. The quotes from Luke and Acts could potentially come from the Gospel of Mars, on. This gospel only exists in fragments, but it seems to be consistent with both Luke and Acts. The philosophy Justin Martyr displays in this document is very consistent with the John epistles, 1st, 2nd, and 3rd John. However, he does not quote from these books. In this document, Justin advocates for the resurrection of the flesh. His theology insists that at some point in the future, the dead will rise from the grave, and that the followers of Jesus will go to heaven in the form of flesh. It's not just their souls that go to heaven. It's a rather boring, long-winded theological text. He doesn't say specifically who his target is. However, he does not display the venom that he showed in the discourse to the Greeks. The subject matter, the nature of resurrection, indicates he's probably addressing the issues of Gnosticism and other versions of Christianity. This text seems to be an answer to the question of whether or not it's just the soul that goes to heaven. Again, he's probably writing to a church, and it's probably a Greek church. In chapter 6, he refers to the works of Epicurus and Plato to prove his point. One will be happy to note that as part of Justin's philosophy, after resurrection you will have to discharge most of the bodily functions of a regular human being. We can only hope that in heaven plenty of outhouses will be provided. The only bodily function that you won't have to deal with is sex, of course. Sex will be strictly prohibited. That seems to take some of the fun out of it, but maybe they'll have a nice theme park or a good fishing hole. That does it for On the Resurrection. Again, we have quotes from probably Luke and Acts, or perhaps the Gospel of Marcion. And though we don't have quotes from the John Epistles, his philosophy is very consistent with these texts. I will definitely be keeping an eye out to see if Justin Martyr ever directly quotes the Epistles of John.